Evidence-based design has determined that humans benefit from exposure to natural daylight. Recent research has discovered an intricate network of receptors and hormonal control centers that physically tie us to the natural day-night cycle. As we spend more and more time indoors, our body's natural processes are being altered. Researchers have begun to study the impact of electric light on the health of our bodies. Circadian lighting is the concept that light can be used to support human health and well-being. This approach is just one component of human-centric design that has gained prominence with the advancement of LED technology. There are currently three techniques that can be used to support circadian lighting design. They are intensity control, tunable white, and spectral tuning. While we have explored the application of circadian lighting in healthcare facilities to support patients and shift workers, we are also exploring circadian lighting solutions in corporate offices and university campuses. The most basic approach is layering light, placing light fixtures in locations that correlate with the elevation of the sun and providing flexibility for users to dim lights in their space. It is a simple concept we've incorporated into our designs even before LEDs. In the morning, bright overhead lights illuminate the room and as evening rolls around, users can switch to localized task lights or wall sconces to reduce the overall brightness. Tunable white fixtures can be used as a means of circadian entrainment with proper light levels. The concept is to mimic daylight by shifting the color temperature in conjunction with light intensity over the course of the day, helping realign our circadian rhythms. This approach typically requires a more complex and automated control system, where the fixtures are tied back to a central system. Finally, there is spectral tuning where the amount of energy in the blue light spectrum is minimized in the late afternoon and evening. Research has shown that prolonged exposure to certain wavelengths of blue light in the evening can negatively impact our bodies by suppressing melatonin production, which helps us sleep, and increasing cortisol production, or adrenaline. Remember, context matters when determining which approach makes sense for your project and client. It is important to understand your goals and objectives, as well as the impact of this technology on the people within the space. Research studies are in their infancy and ongoing. Professional Lighting Consultant can help you navigate the research and determine which circadian solution is appropriate for your project.